who are these women on these uh, marriage agencies here in Ukraine? N not a big number of them go to the agency because they are desperately, rationally, devotedly trying to find a husband. They go because they are sucked in the system the same way as the men are sucked in the system of online dating by the big companies. So uh, both sides are dragged inside this machine of the online dating internationally, right? So the, there are also a lack of really devoted men. And I could speak a lot about non-devoted badasses that came here. They are non, not only bad women, they are bad men also, like everywhere. But when we are on a country that there is a lack of almost everything, and there someone appears and show a tool that is uh, dating, international dating, that can bring them an added value that starts to be a good husband with a financial capacity to help her, who knows her kid from the first marriage and maybe the mother that is widow and lives with these uh, survival uh, pensions that can go below a hundred dollars a month. Here we go again, money and woman, we don't separate the things. So these people think that maybe they will strike, maybe they will have luck, like the men also think maybe I will have luck. Mm. We always want to have the luck and the problems always happen to the others and never to us, but it's not the case, right? So. Yeah. Somebody needs to understand with experience to judge somehow who is the real man, who is the real woman, and if they have above all characteristics to be a match. Mm -hmm. It doesn't mean bad or her bad. Sometimes both are good, but they still don't match. And when we have a lack of time to make this happen, then it's better we have someone that can help us to understand who is who and also point out the mistakes. And honestly speaking, most of my coaching time is pointing mistakes because I'm not going to educate anyone to be a different person. The, the man need to match with someone that match who he is, whatever he is, but that is the match.